Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be explaining the whole Chapter 2 Season 5 storyline. Now, I know that I mentioned that I haven't been enjoying Fortnite lately, but one thing that you can always enjoy in Fortnite is the Fortnite storyline. Not only will the storyline lead to a huge event at the end of the season, but it also will keep us on our toes. But before we get into it, guys, make sure to drop a like on the video, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and also check out RelayStudios.com, where I sell all of my merch. Um, it's pretty comfortable, in my opinion. I, it's the most comfortable clothing that I own, and uh, you can learn more about me, so I'd really appreciate that. Also, I started a reaction channel. It'll be right uh, here, somewhere above me. Anyways, link to that is in the description, as always, and I appreciate all the support, guys. Without further ado, let's get right into it. In the aftermath of the battle to save reality, Asian Jonesy wakes up in his office and answers the ringing phone. A mysterious woman, theorized to be a superior, tells him that although the zero point isn't destroyed, it is still exposed and unstable. This means that Agent Jonesy must go into the loop to reseal the bridge, stabilize the zero point, and not let anyone escape the loop. Jonesy then takes a backpack containing a strange rip device. Before the woman on the phone can inform him not to draw any attention from the seven, Jonesy already left. As all the IO guards rushed to the area, he entered a room which presumably was the same room where the zero point was once contained. In the room, he creates a signal to track all hunters across realities and finds seven signals. A large ball of energy is then sent into a giant hole at the center of the room, created by the zero point being pulled from the gateway by Galactus, pulling Jonesy in and supposedly, although quite confusingly, teleporting him upwards into the zero point. Now hovering high above the island with his goal to find the hunters, he returns with Mandalorian, Reese, Mancake, Maeve, Condor, Lexa, and Menace. These hunters are given the task to cause chaos throughout the island, capture several bounties, and keep anyone from escaping the loop. While these hunters do this, the organization is going to plan their next actions. After the zero point was exposed, it altered the center of the island into a sandy area filled with large strange crystals and very odd effects. By now, the Marvel heroes have already left this reality, returning to the unknown. Salty Springs was altered into Salty Towers, and Frenzy Farm was altered into Colossal Coliseum. Along with this, multiple objects from around the island had begun to appear. They appeared in the same locations that they did on the original island. The islands were speculated to combine. At the same time that was happening, the organization known as the Imagined Order had begun to appear very often. They built Stealthy Stronghold, which appeared to be a large fortress housing a jungle. Near the center of the island, they also built Hunter's Haven. Hunter's Haven is the location which all hunters stay as they remain in this reality. As the IO organization slowly began to show themselves around the island, people also began to partly take notice in them, as well as the loop and the zero point, although most don't know much. There is one person that remained on the island for a very long time that continues to see, hiding in the edges of the island near Camp Cod. Bunker Jonesy has continued to see what he has witnessed, ever since he was apparently exposed to the full strength of the loop for a long time. He was a snapshot of Agent Jonesy when he first passed the zero point, being trapped in the loop as an outsider for at least several decades. He then began to see visions of the loop and events from the past and the future. He continues to see the loop, however it is currently too dangerous to even think of escaping the loop. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and make sure to check out RelayStudios.com to check out my merch and support me on my full-time journey. And of course, make sure to use code RelayTS in the Fortnite item shop to support me and have a great rest of your day. Peace out.